Hey everyone, it's Dr. Crad. Today I will bring you along on my first experience with the ARC Duo. Reducing astigmatism can improve the quality of your vision while you're not wearing glasses. At the time of cataract surgery, one can reduce astigmatism with a lens implant such as a torque lens or the light adjustable lens. You can also reduce astigmatism by strategically placing your main incision. Or you can reduce astigmatism by creating relaxing incisions called LRIs or arcuate incisions. Historically, these LRIs were divided into either laser LRIs or manual LRIs. Today, I'm going to show you a new way to reduce a patient's astigmatism. When placed properly, LRIs reduce your astigmatism by flattening the overly steep meridian of your cornea. This results in a more spherical shape and better vision. There have been two ways to perform LRIs during cataract surgery in the past, either with femtosecond laser or manually. Laser is prettier, precisely arcuate or curved, but also much more expensive. Manual LRIs work too, are much cheaper, but definitely not as pretty or precise. A new device by MST called the Arc Duo attempts to bridge that gap. MST is famous for making beautifully engineered surgical instruments for eye surgery. I currently use their capsular rexus forceps during cataract surgery, and also if I ever need to cut out a lens from the eye, I use their IOL graspers and scissors to do that. The purpose of the Arc Duo device is to create manual LRIs with laser-like curvature and accuracy. Today's video is sponsored by MST. But one condition I had for them is that they watch this video for the first time alongside all of you, and that they would let me perform my review independently, and that there would be no script approval process or requirement of any kind. Historically, most other companies would never agree to this. But if a company believes that they have a good product that's beneficial for patients, then why not? So thank you MST for supporting my channel and for being confident enough in your product and letting me share my thoughts. All right. So here's the Arc Duo. You can create arcuate incisions at either a 9mm or 10mm optical zone. It includes a template to make 15, 30, 45, or 60 degree arcuate incisions. These can be either single or dual. There's a syringe and suction ring to keep the eye still as this is performed. Here you can see this Play-Doh eyeball that I tried it on. You'll want to mark the eye in pre-op. Here I mark the eye at 3 and 9 o'clock, and then place the colored template you desire inside the suction ring and align it with your axis of treatment. In this case, I'm using the light blue template, which is for 30 degree arcuates. I aligned it at 90 degrees for my treatment, and then I asked my scrub tech to apply suction with the included syringe. As suction is confirmed, I use the 9mm optical zone blades, as it's written here. I place the blade in the guide, starting all the way on one side of the template, and then rotate to the other side, release suction, and you're done. And here I have two really beautiful curved arcuates at the nine millimeter zone. And what do you think? They certainly look better than a traditional manual LRI. This nine millimeter optical zone blade cuts at a 600 micron depth. Next, I'll show you how to create a single arcuate incision with the Arc Duo. So you take the blade that you want, whether it's the nine millimeter or 10 millimeter optical zone, and you just use a forcep like a mosquito and you pull one of the blades out directly, just like this. And now you have a single blade and you can place this single arcuate wherever you like. You need to make sure the ocular surface is wet with BSS, so I'm using a wet sponge to moisten the ocular surface. Here I'm using the light blue template, which indicates a 30 degree arcuate cut. I orient the template at the 20 degree axis, each small tick mark is five degrees. I align the suction ring level on the eye and then tell my scrub tech to apply suction. I then place the blade within the template, starting all the way on one side of the template and then rotate to the other side. Release suction and I'm done. Super quick and easy. And that's it. I'll zoom in so you can see it. A beautiful arcuate. Here's how it looks at the slit lamp. Beautifully curved like a laser. Femtosecond lasers can cost over a hundred grand, sometimes a couple hundred grand. And on top of that, there are click fees each time you use it. There's no big machine you need to buy with the Arc Duo, just the cost of the single use package, which hopefully is less than your laser click fee. So who is this for? I can see this being used in an ASC or OBS office-based surgery that either doesn't have a laser 
or if their click fees for the laser are too high. Perhaps treat astigmatism in the clinic. The only time I think it's a harder sell is if you already have a laser with low click fees, but overall it creates beautiful arcuates similar to laser with ease. Things I would love to see? I would love to see it written on each arcuate template how many degrees are being treated, but until then you gotta use the reference sheet. Also, I wish the suction ring was a bit more compact to fit in smaller, tighter eyes. I hope you found this video helpful. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.